Supreme Court no agree for the PDP article appeal, sake of say he no get married. INEC don't give assurance of free and better elections for Bayelsa and Kogi states. Federal Executive Council don't approve 5.72 billion naira for NDIC office day. And the kidnappers don't carry another judge for inside a Joe state. Good evening, my people. This is Nawa Zobia Max TV. And as it take happen, now we day inside. My name is Adate Owonkwe. On top of the first story, where I carry come, Federal Executive Council on Wednesday don't approve 5.72 billion naira for construction and the consultancy services for Nigerian Deposit Insurance Corporation Office them. Minister of Finance, Budget and National Planning, Zainab Ahmed, Nine yam this one gives state house to we people after the fake meeting with the vice president Yemi Oshimbajo being lead for state house inside Abuja. She talks say 3.23 billion naira nine then approved for construction of NDI seasonal office for inside Bauchi State. And according to her, she talks a 2.49 billion naira nine then see approved for consultancy services for stage three work on top NDIC corporation office them for Abuja and for Lagos. Minister of Aviation, Hadi Sirika, talks say FEC now don't approve 574 million naira for insurance of College of Aviation for Zaria. MC talks say 271 million, now in the approved for parameter fencing of a Portacot International Airport, where B say don't they like that now since 2011. And on behalf of Transport Ministry, Transportation Ministry, the Minister of Information, Lai Mohamed Toxi, FEC don't approve 718 million for the supply of land mobile security scanners for inside the Lagos port. And that one I go carry us enter the next story we we get. The Supreme Court now no agree for the appeal where Atiku Abubakar and PDP carry come, where we say they challenge the judgment of the presidential appeal panel where talk say President Muhammad Buhari win the election. The seven member justice them of the Supreme High Court where Chief uh, Justice of Nigeria will be Justice Tanko Muhammad bin Lid. Now him no agree for the appeal sake of say he no get married. They can't talk, say, then go give the reason why we say then take this decision later. As they yarn on top of the judgment, lawyer to PDP and Atiku will be Mike Ezekome. He talks, say, call this court one use style now to avoid the plenty tension we they for inside the country. That strategy is to prevent, prevent unnecessary tension, gripping the country once more, like during elections. At least today, the baby has been delivered, not aborted. Something drastic has to be done about our electoral laws and the electoral jurisprudence. Even as in CDM the for there, APC lawyer now calling and say the decision where BC the court to take, it really shows in our president Muhammad Buhari now win the election. The chapter paragraphs and lines having to do with 2019 election, especially the presidential aspect, has been laid to rest until 2023. It has been a night of long knives, but we thank God that it has ended peacefully. We should thank God to have the type of judges we have at the Supreme Court. And this serves something, serves something that has, has been laid to rest. The issue is this server, INEC never said there are no server. They said INEC had a particular server, www.factsdontlie.nigeria.com. Uh, uh, we say INEC does not have that type of server. And at this one, I'm going to enter another story. Now, still court matter. All Progressive Congress, APC, and the People's Democratic Party, will be PDP, all of them now don't put them out on top of the judgment of Supreme High Court for the February 23 presidential election. Inside the separate talk where BC then talk, the national chairman of APC and the PDP vice presidential candidate will be Oga Peter Obi, even them, both of them been talk their mind. 
Ogaden Sushomele for APC Talk C. Him see the judgment as a victory and say no before President Muhammadu Buhari or for the party, but now for Nigerians. In second, say the president now will concentrate to put mind on top of the work where we say he ain't supposed to do on how to move the country to go front. The issue of the election is now behind us, and uh, I believe the government, the people of Nigeria, will work in unison to take the Nigeria uh, project to the next level. So I am excited, I am happy, and I think this is not about Buhari, it's not about APC, it's about Nigeria. And I believe in this business, Nigerians are all winners. Yes. Elections have been conducted, the courts have pronounced, the second the Supreme Court has now pronounced, and I believe this is it, this is the last bus stop. Our election can be determined on the basis of fat.lie.com, <laughs> hosted by unknown uh, Yahoo Yahoo boys. And still on top of the matter, Oga Obi still and say the thing shock and where we sick of the decision where we say the court take and say they need to do something about the electoral law of we country. I believe that the election and the result was not the result of lawful vote cast. But the process has come to the end. I thank all those who are involved, the lawyers, the judges, all of you from the 40 states. This election and the judgment is not about President Buhari or His Excellency Alaji Atiku Abubakar. It is about the future of our country. And for inside the next story where we carry come, Court of Appeal for Inside Sokoto Division on Wednesday don't return Senator Ibrahim Lembaba and Balarabi Kakali as Senator and House of Representative member for the National Assembly. For the judgment where Justice Frederick Oho been read, the court talks say the appeal where Lembaba and Kakali been carry come during the 2019 election say it don't succeed and say them give, they will give the full story of the judgment later. Justice Soho been put at one side. The judgment with Sokoto State Election Petition Tribunal been dismissed the petition of the people where they carry the matter come to favor the people where the matter day on top of their head will be APC candidates. And as it be so, the APC candidates where they win the election, where they for the seats now. Now, Abubakar Shehu Tambual for Sokoto South Senatorial District and Ali Shehu where they say they represent Bodinga. Dange Shuni and Tureta Federal Constituency. We shall probably come out from inside that one, run, enter, INEC. As it be say, remain like 17 days to Kogi and Bayasa election. INEC now don't come, say, don't, they, they prepare now, they don't prepare well for smooth election. INEC Chairman Professor Mahmoud Yakubu, now him announced this one on Wednesday for Inside Abuja, for Inside the quarterly meeting we then get with media people. Professor Yakubu talk say the commission go work with people we get mouth for inside the matter that's na stakeholders so that they go fit check everything where be say if he spoiled this election. Him talk say I neck now go partner with media people to make sure say they cover everything we go see Shelley for inside the election. Amos Dunia where be say they represent the president of Nigerian Union of Journalists will be Chris Isiguzo. He been tell INEC, say, make them make sure, say, journalists work now, go be very easy for inside the election. And we come out for that one, enter the one where we say no sweet for body at all. Some men now, some kidnappers, now we hear say, they don't go carry another judge for inside Benin for a dual state. Justice Choma Wonsu Iheme of Benin Court of Appeal, now he then kidnap on Wednesday as she they go court. The Edo State Commissioner of Police, Damala Muhammad, now he confirmed this one where BC happened as he talks as he been now. They don't define those people so that they go fit to rescue the judge. The kidnapper has been carried justice most to Iheme some days after they carried justice Abdul Dogo of Federal High Court for Akure for Ondo State, con release them on Tuesday last week for the border between Edo and Ondo State. We enter another Tory where we still carry come. As part of the effort now to address the matter of security where we say they grow for inside the country, people will start be well well on top security matter where they call experts. They don't call now, they present one application where we say they call them quick emergency reporting and response system for inside Abuja. 
As they represent the whole thing for inside day, the security experts them now can they learn about how they, they use all this machine them. Honorable Akamode talk say if they apply what they need for inside this machine, say they go fit use them well and they go fit get sharp sharp response for any matter of emergency. He still talk say if them do the app to work well, say they do already arrange them to work with Nigerian police force. In the face of growing safety and security challenges globally, and in line with the trend of adapting technology to address various aspects of living, we are publicly introducing to the Nigerian market Another still day yam for dear representative of the Federal Road Safety Corp will be Deputy Corp Commandant J.I.A.K. He talks a need day for the media now to let plenty people know how to use this machine to avoid the information where be say in no correct. Our situational awareness app called the Quick Emergency Reporting and Response System. The acronym is QERRS. The QERRS is a web-based safety and incident management application that makes it possible for a person in distress or at an incident point to swipe on the application and trigger the report of an occurrence. As they see the young for their they tell members of the public, say, may them try, may them not abuse this machine and see make them use and do waiting if they say they make the machine for. Now this one now go carry us enter the next to be where we get. According to World Health Organization, the Yan say to they do open caca for open place. If it cause plenty things for inside our environment and they bad body matter. As some people now the Yan say that they do all these short put the poo outside because of say na poverty they cause them and say government now no provide better toilet when they forfeit do all these ones put. But even as toilets they are available for some places, some people still like to they do open caca. And now the question will be say, where be say then keep Nigeria on top of this short put matter where they walk her up and down? Our Tory person will be in a dog glass, now he get more. No be lie to talk say it they very common for people to see poo poo of human beings scatter everywhere, even for cities and many communities inside Nigeria. Because of this story, we no sweet belly at all. Nigeria don't get one bad rating as a country with the highest number of people with a poo poo for open space inside Africa and second for the world after India. According to the 2018 National Outcome Routine Mapping Norm, now 47 million people for the country they poo poo for public. Even as the country don't lose 455 billion naira due to poor sanitation. Many questions don't raise as to why many Nigerians prefer to expose their poo poo for public, even though they know say the thing they affect people health. Now, so we carry enter one Ruga community inside Abuja to know how the people for the area they manage. 67% that are here we have toilet, but 40% don't have toilet. We have given one car that you, if you want to toilet, you go and pay 20 naira and, and dish there. And if you don't have that 20 naira to toilet, you will go somewhere else. If you enter there, you say you don't have money, the person can leave you to do it. After where you get the money, you can come pay it. No problem about that. So actually here we don't have so much uh, problem concerning uh, health, uh, about hygiene of the area. Because we have youth that we organize always, uh, we month, every month, every quarter of the month, we are cleaning all the environment, we are going around everywhere to see that every house are clean and all right. As I say, some of the residents build makeshift toilets. Many of them still they go operate for the bush sector. While some will not get toilet, they go pay small money to offload. No go see any the thing inside. That's what people like up. We the enjoy that. Although experts don't yarn say areas where people they poo poo for public, they face many sanitation problems where they lead to sickness. And if they no manage the sickness well, people they can put on top the matter. So if you see place where they dig borehole. And you know far from where open field they and people they poo poo, it they affect that water. If it causes diseases like cholera, 
That's why you go to hear cholera outbreak, cholera outbreak. Now, because the water where people they use wash vegetables, they use cook, they drink, it don't they contaminated. Then, apart from that um, cholera, it they cause things like diarrhea, even typhoid. So, it they pose serious health risks for us as human beings, as Nigerians. Another reality be say it they very common to see people they sell food, sleep, eat, and even drink close to poo poo for we country. For 1923. Mahatma Gandhi will be the former Prime Minister for India. Talk say sanitation they very, very important pass independence. For Wazobia Max TV, my name na na Douglas. Sharply with a comeback with business story, make you no go anywhere. <music> And for inside the business, Nigerian Customs Service, Area 1, Command Zone C, for inside the Port Harcourt now, they don't see some things where BC people use to backdoor bring inside the country, where reach over 900 million naira. The Controller General of Custom, Webi Hamid Ali, now he tell to read people, after BC you don't go check all the things where BC then sees for Nigerian Port Authority for inside the Port Harcourt. Him saying that 32 bags of pangolin scales, where BC reach like 800 million naira, now in then see for inside the cargo wing of Port Harcourt International Airport as in they go China. In see talk, say the 10 containers where BC say it carry tin tomato and two containers where it carry canned mackerel fish, where BC say reach like 90 million naira, now in then still see for Port Harcourt seaport. Six million. Declaration contravenes section 161, subsection 2, 3, and 4 of SEMA, laws of the Federation of Nigeria 2004, and the consignments are therefore ceased. Gentlemen of the press, it, it, is, it, is, it is becoming clearer for those who had some doubt about the rationale for partial closure, closure of the land borders, to indeed that we indeed have a lot to gain. Security is improving. Farmers are enjoying more patronage and are able to engage more hands and our own well-being has also been increased because the drugs that are being imported, especially tramadol and the rest, which are harmful to the health of our, and well-being of our people, have been reduced drastically. Security, for those of you who must have been reading the newspapers and listening to the, the electronic uh, media, the rate of banditry, kidnapping, armed robbery, and of course the activities of the Boko Harams in the Northeast has reduced drastically. And the, the, the simple conclusion is that either the arms and ammunition that is being used by these miscreants is no longer available, or the miscreants who do transcend from border to come into Nigeria and commit this act. Are, are no longer allowed to come in as a result of the border closure. Either of the two, ours is a gain because the life of our people is now secured, our people are safe, and then they can go about their, doing their, their businesses without hindrance. Officers now of Portacourt Area 1 Command don't receive plenty hailings for this one where BC say them do. We can really show say custom service don't increase their work as border don't close. And for inside another business story, we will get for this evening. Central Bank of Nigeria now don't promise say textile jobs then where BC don't lost since how many years ago. Say they go try now to bring them back very soon. Oga God in MFLA, Nainyan this one for inside Abuja, as the armed forces, Nigerian police, National Youth Service Corps, and the Nigerian Textile and Garment Manufacturers Association, plus including the National Cutting Association and the Gainers Association of Nigeria, been they signed the two letter where BC then call Memorandum of Understanding, that one now, MOU. The governor they vex because of say over 150 textile mills them nine BC don't close for inside the Nigeria. But he can't give promise, can't give assurance. See, then they do different things now to bring back the sector and to create better jobs for Nigerians. With a sharply come back with sport story, make you not go anywhere.
For inside sports for this evening, we hear Seogeni Ognazi of Nigeria. He don't set now to return to action after he don't been get himself for the muzzle weakness way he been get. The Super Eagles midfielder been do surgery for him leg for December 2018 and he never play now for like 10 months. But as it be so, they say he don't join in teammates to train on Tuesday as in club doctor will be Hakan Ayaz, the supervise. My people now all the to read this, but before we go, make I still remind us of all our top to read them for this evening. Supreme Court now no agree for the PDP article appeal, take off say you no know, get married. And INEC now don't give assurance of free and better elections for Bielsa and Kogi states. Federal Executive Council don't approve 5.72 billion naira for NDIC office. And the kidnappers don't carry another judge for inside a do state. Now all the Tory bidis as it take happen, I make you remember seeing our Wazobia Max TV now we still day inside. My name is Adati Omupi. Una good evening.